Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com, and today we're going to try and take a quick look at Windows ISO Downloader, which can download Windows 7, 8, and 10 ISOs, as well as most copies of Microsoft Office, I believe. Let's get a double click here. It's portable. So just run it. I believe 2007, 2010, and 2013, 16, they can't. It's been locked down, but it'll give you the proper links to get to where you need to go for those. So we're going to use Windows 7 for an example here. It's very simple to use. There's a couple little hiccups that might confuse some people, so I thought I'd go over that. As you can see, aside from a few typos, Windows 10 editions below, even though we're looking at 7. I wonder if it does it everywhere. Maybe he'll spot this or see the video and catch this as a bug. I hadn't seen it before. Yes, he did. He's got the same thing in every version. We found ourselves a little bug, a little typo. Anyway, so we're at Windows 7. You want to select your edition. For most of us, you should know what you're using or want. Starter, pretty rare. Home, home premium, professional, or ultimate. I use professional. However, you may get confused if you come down you and suddenly notice NK and KN. N has the multimedia support removed from install. This was back when the European market had Windows without Windows Media Player, Media Center, DVD Maker. You might remember the uh, sanctions against Microsoft uh, by the European Union for violating antitrust laws, so that's why it has those versions. If you happen to see the K version, this is uh, South Korean version. And of course, it, the KN, which combines K plus N. So you can do the math on that one. So for most of us in the United States, using the regular version you can pick whatever you need right here at the top and again you'll have the same thing with any of these so I will take Windows 7 professional I will click confirm it will typically offer a language it will offer 32 and 64 bit if there's an option as you can see it is here and you can actually copy the link so that you have it by simply pressing it or just click the button and go there it is Windows 7 Pro SP1, 64-bit, the ISO, it's a disk image file, and it is coming from Microsoft.com. So we can save it, and when you're done, as you can see, we're getting a fast download speed, 3 gigs. So it's really handy because how many times have you gone looking for the ISO and been led all over the Internet to try and find what it was you wanted? And this guy just took a simple little idea and threw it together and keeps track of the links for you. So it's 300K. Again, it's portable. So when you get all done with it, you've got the Windows copy that you want. You don't need to keep it on your computer. You can simply get rid of it, and it's gone, and that's that. As always, we thank you for watching. The download link will be right below, and we'll see you next time.